what does this happy money concept was it what is it all about and what is happy money and what is unhappy money mm -hmm. okay so in this uh there's um uh two kinds of money i figured out as i studied money one uh type of money is happy money that makes you smile when you receive it and also it gives you joy when you spend it and the other money is called unhappy money when you receive money you feel frustrated and also when you pay bills when you want to pay do something you get worried you get upset you get um sometimes angry and sometimes worried that kind of thing is called unhappy money so it's the same amount of money but the energy is different so for example if your grandparents send you some money and for your happy birthday card and then you feel very happy but when you just uh um uh just uh get money from the clients that uh, who who hate to pay you then you feel like you know i don't i don't feel good yes. about receiving the money so money given out of appreciation to you you feel good but if money is paid out for uh out of frustration and anger sometimes and then you feel like ooh so that is a difference between happy money and unhappy money yeah, sure. Also, I like the point in the book where you say that usually people think your yeah, money is such a problem. People quarrel about the money, uh, give all their energy, you know, about uh, how to how to achieve money. And you say mm -hmm. that money is not a problem. The problem is right. us. What does it yes. mean? Yeah. So, um, you know, money is just neutral energy, but we just put meaning to money. So when we feel happy about our life and then uh, if we just do what we love and then as a result, if you get money, then we are very satisfied with the money we receive. But oftentimes we get frustrated because uh, our income is not high enough and also um, the rising cost of things like food and energy, gas, petrol uh, and, and electricity, everything is going up. And then our income is not as high. So we feel uh, this uh, very big stress around money. So when we feel stress, stressful, and then we put bad energy into money. And when we feel thankful, we put good energy to money and we can feel the difference. Yes, that's very well said. Also, uh, I remember uh, that you said in the book, like uh, I, I wrote it down, we earn and spend money either with love or mm -hmm. with fear and mm -hmm. uh, the how we re relate to the money is actually how we relate to life that's very yes. interesting it's very uh, general so can you talk a little bit more about this concept yes so when we receive money with love and when we give out money with love then we feel so blessed you know we we feel so happy that we can give money to uh the cashier person or the re at the restaurant and the money we pay will be paid for the cashier's person's uh, kids' lunch money the day after. And also, so like we feel that the money that we give out will be um, making somebody happy. On the other hand, sometimes we feel angry that the, 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 something is so expensive, we feel like ripped off and then we get upset. So uh, it's just us who feels love or anger, you know, depending on what we feel about money. So we have to be very, very careful about what we project onto money. Money is not good or bad, it's just neutral, but we are the one who give meaning to money. So um, I, I wish just since we are small, we teach them, uh, kids, um, about money, that uh, money is not the root of all evil, money mm. could be the root of all love.